This just in guys, 10 different firms with widespread record keeping failures the SEC is charging them. So here's the entire list right here, but for example, Interactive Brokers agrees to pay $35 million and different firms are also agreeing to pay a massive, massive penalty. Now the problem is that these fines are massive to you and I, but for some of these corporations, these fines are just a drop in the bucket, which is what a lot of the apes are concerned about. This is an oldie, but still a goodie. It says, this is why we need to hold till it's 500K per share each. Don't get mad, get even. And then it's a simple tweet, but a crazy reminder of what's actually going on here. It says, banks collected $12.4 billion in overdraft fees back in 2020. That means that banks took over $12 billion from people with no money in the form of fees during a global lockdown. Now, all I can say about this is it really puts everything into perspective now, doesn't it? This is very important, apes. Look at this. It says AMC, according to the street, AMC and Adam Aaron has lost the support of the apes. True or false? So right now, 4,149 votes, which is a pretty decent amount, honestly. Out of all those votes, 82.5% still say I support AMC and Adam Aaron. And 175 say that they don't. Now, this is honestly kind of surprising to me. With all the FUD and everything that I've been seeing online as of recently, I would have guessed that it would probably be like 70-30, but it's really cool to see that the majority... More than the majority, honestly. Support Adam Aaron and AMC. But I want to hear from you guys down below. Comment yes or no. Do you still support Adam Marin and AMC? Comment yes. Or if you do not support, no problem. Just comment down below. No. Short sellers don't understand. If I were going to sell my AMC position, I'm at the point where I would be in a huge depression. It's zero or win for me and millions of others. I don't let opportunity get away. We truly love a stock. Now, this state makes a good point, and to be honest with you, a lot of us that got into AMC originally are down so much on our shares that at this point, just like this ape says, it's pretty much zero or hero, nothing in between. And a lot of the posts that I've been seeing in the overall AMC sediment in the ape community is pretty much the same. So my final question is, when are the short sellers going to understand? This is insane. It says, SEC Chair Gary Gensler has said that AI's ability to generate deep fake content that easily fools humans poises a genuine threat to the financial markets per Bloomberg. And this ape said it perfectly. I think a bigger threat to the financial markets is the lack of transparency. Bingo. Nefarious shorts, yes. Naked shorting, spoofing, and things like removing buy buttons, etc. Should we go on? Comment down below, apes. Other things that Gary Gensler should be more concerned about than AI. Make sure to check out all these other videos to catch up on all the latest AMC Stock DD and information you need.